What's up guys, this is Cher talking, welcome back to my channel. On today's video, I'll show you how to defeat a battle with real queen Vino attacks. The latest one, this one is not that hard if you have the right units. It can be a pretty short fight and it again showcases the power of lightning damage squads if you have the newest meddling. Real queen Vino will attack you with all the physical types. Shadow and sun damage will also try to apply ailments on you, but there is a trick to prevent all of this. It is weak to Pierce and Shadow, but then you ask me, why are you bringing Kihachi? Because it still works, and I'll explain. Well, it's not really weak to Slash, as it needed 35 points of weakness in order to trigger weak on the screen. And that's what uh, also leads to Kihachi chasing with her first style. But the latest one does not need that, and that's why we are bringing her. Okay, so the idea here is to decrease the defense of the enemy, specifically lightning defense in order to improve our damage we can also improve lightning damage via meddling skill uh spin lightning slash has a chance to up increase your lightning damage but it's all about the passives that already apply a weak point on the enemy that increases the defense of the enemy by 20 percent last for two turns view stack on the second turn and then on turn three will be insane and then uh, even if you are not landing weak attacks to trigger laceration it hatches to obliterate the enemy that's why this combination is so good. We also have Khalid. It's not really required. If you don't have Khalid, you can bring, for example, the newest Merlot Syra, Silver, maybe even Creator will work here. And we are also bringing Matriarch. Why? Because Matriarch will allow us to self buff when we are attacking. We're going to finish this in three turns. You could also use someone like Liz. That will also work, but if she does not buff enough. Uh, I believe maybe Leon will be better. And if you don't have Rock Bouquet, you can bring another debuffer. Even James will work. Even Asper may work because you can also buff break the enemy because the enemy self buffs STR, Intelligence, and Dexterity by very small. So it does not stack so high. If you have a strong debuffer, it should work. But the whole idea of this fight is to just improve your damage. Both Rock and Matriarch will increase your status when you are attacking. So you will reach very high heights alongside decreasing the enemy resistance. As for the formation I'm using here, Guard Focus. Khalid is in the back. Doesn't really matter if he's in the back or Madeline, because they will stack so much. I actually uh, placed Khalid here because he does have a very big uh, defense down, but I feel like it may be even better to use Madeline if you want. Uh, as for equipment, you can see that I brought stuff to decrease physical type and then Shadow and Sun with my equipments and I didn't really need to bring the right equipments for ailment resistance because I was fully protected during the fight but if you don't have reliable debuffers or buffers maybe bring those accessories as well as I wanted to improve damage I brought the new uh no, no I actually did not if I had then I would have improved my damage there are accessories that can improve your damage so use those if you have space like those here with that said let's go for the run Okay, so we start this fight here by use off Rock Bouquet Blue Rose Road. Madeline can go with her Thunderstorm Annihilation. And Matriarch will use her Eon of Exaltation. We actually are lead using Thunderbolt Slash already. Kihachi will be using First Fighting Spirit. We only need the real queen to attack Kihachi so that she triggers Brace. Real Queen does not attack much on turn 1, and that's why we are applying some defensive boosts via Madeline and also decrease damage taken via Rock Bouquet, especially if she goes before the enemy, right? Yeah, that's enough. This will take a lot of damage on Kihachi since she has less defenses on start anyway. On Shower will hurt her. Won't trigger Brace yet, but Pulverize did. Okay, so everyone is now. Uh, ready to do a lot of damage. Look at the damage of Khalid already. He even had a full chase sequence. Perfect. Now Kihachi is on overdrive. And instead of Blue Rose Rose, we can use Lighting of Darkness or Psycho Boom or any other debuff skill if you have. Captive Thunder will improve your damage, but Lightning of Darkness debuffs. It's important because Real Queen will try to apply Charm on this turn. She's also self-buffing, and I didn't bring Dark Wash because it was not needed. 
And now Madeline will use Spin and Lightning Slash. Metroch will be using Heaven's Heal. And Khalid Thunder Blade. With Kihachi using her Lightning Blade 8 Fold. Hopefully everyone will be on Overdrive on turn 3. It's not a guarantee though. See, even without the enemy being weak to Lightning or Slash, we are breaking through 1 million already. That's what happens. Lightning attack increase it. <laughs> Lighting of Darkness debuffing the enemy. Tree Flower buffing will. It will be even better if she had chased. But you can see that we are not being afflicted with paralysis or charm or anything. Okay, we only have three carrots on overdrive. That should be good enough. I will use Lightning of Darkness still. Then Thunderstorm Annihilation. Because if you don't beat the enemy yet, this will help. Heaven's Heal because the fight's just ending. Uh, Thunderbolt Slash. I think Khalid will finish this fight in my test runs. He did. But it may be the case that we finish with Hachi. Even better that Madeline went first. Weak attacks doing 1.4 million already. Remember that Rock also does Lightning. Crazy love. Whoa. Look, that's the end. Whoa. More than 2 million per hit. Insane. We won't even need to attack with the lead. That's how we break the game, guys. By debuffing defenses since we cannot keep buffing on this fight. Pretty short fight if you have the right units. If you don't, well, we'll do another video in another time. With that said, this is the end of the video. If you use a different squad, share here in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. And if you want to support the channel, we have links in the description. Hope to see you soon in the next one. Goodbye.